thanks for checking back in. Today, we'll be discussing the oblique, cloud, and mask features in DraftSync. I found that these commands encourage you to express your premature ideas in your designs. Starting with the oblique icon under the Annotate tab in the Dimensions section of the ribbon. This function customizes the angle of the extension lines of your linear dimensions. Just select the feature, specify your dimension, and then the angle you want the extension line to embody. Keep in mind the draft site also gives you the option to select your dimension and then click and drag to define your angle of choice, rather than manually typing the angle's degree into the command window. The cloud feature is located under the markup section in the annotate tab of the ribbon, and it identifies sections of your designs that may need revision. It does this by inserting rectangular, elliptical, and freehand shaped cloud entities over any section that want to revise later on. Similarly, the mask feature allows you to draw an entity that covers any portion of your drawing that you'd like to keep hidden. I found that both the cloud and mask features encourage me to experiment with new ideas, because I know that anyone looking at my drafts will see that certain parts are not finished or ready to be reviewed yet. So try out these features for yourself to do more with your draft site experience. If you're looking to learn more, visit the blog page or visit draftset.com.